Joe Beer Master, the car master. Today, I'll show you how to clean the throttle body out. We're not taking it out of the car. We're going to do it the simplest way to see if that works. When the car, you start it up in the beginning, it kind of hesitates. So there's no codes, no engine lights. So I believe the throttle body's dirty. So you want to check the air filter. I opened it up on your car. That is a new filter. So I'm going to disconnect this hose from the throttle body right down in there. I already disconnected it right there. You can see it. And I don't want to disconnect any sensors. Then it's going to start throwing a code. So what I'm going to do, I know it's hard to see right there, that little round thing in there. Let's see if we can move it out of the way. Right in there, that gets a little gummy and dirty. You can see it's dirty. So I'm going to get a little carb cleaner. In this case, I'm using 2 plus 2. Spray it in there real good. You can see it's dirty. It could be as simple as that. Just spray it in there. Then I'll wipe it out with a rag. I know Fords are notorious for this. I had a Ford Explorer before and it was really gummy and solved it as soon as I started cleaning it. Get a rag and get it in there and wipe it. This is the simplest way to do this. We can do this a couple times. Work that out. Looks like it's getting cleaner and it will loosen it up. Give it some more. See, it's getting on there. I mean, I've seen worse than this. This really cleans it out. All right. That looks spick and span right there. Now I'm going to put the hose back on, tighten the clamp, and then start it up. And I think that should have corrected our problem. Joe Beer Master, this should be the same for most newer cars. So I hope this helped. Some people take the whole body out and clean it. If it's that bad, you may have to do that. All right, thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Take care.